on The Walking Dead. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. I want to find my parents. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> yeah, why? Clementine? Clementine! Oh. Oh. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Maybe you should stay with the boat. Okay, sure. Clementine! Hey guys, welcome back to The Walking Dead, episode 5. My name is Silver, and I hope you enjoy, you will enjoy this episode. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here! All I want is the girl! Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt! Clementine, are, are you alright? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Holy... Where have you taken her? This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. What do you want from me? Whatever it is, I'll do it. You can let her go. I want you to never hurt anybody again. This isn't a kidnapping, Lee. Then what is it? Then what is it? A rescue. What do you mean by rescue, my friend? Just hold on, Clementine. I'm coming for you. Yeah. Don't worry, pal. We'll get her back. How's that feeling? Not great. Not great. My hand is hot, and it's thumping a little bit. You seem okay, for now. Yeah, totally. We don't have much time. Yeah, that's right. Shit. We've got to close We're the door. We're about to have a lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets here. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. Try to find another way out of here. So he knows. He knows. My God. But to think, quite surprising he can think rationally right now. As after all he's been through. Honestly. Impressive, Kenny. Impressive. What's this? Looks like a car jack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. Just surgical supplies. Nothing. Skill. This isn't gonna help. Uh. Oh. Looks like Vernon and his people cleared their shit out of here in a hurry. Where the hell did they go? Um. Nothing through here. Damn. I was kinda hoping they dug some secret tunnels or something. 
do you think they are, Kenny? They are still humans. Um. Alright. I'll have these doors open in two seconds. Are you sure nothing is behind the door? Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Oh shit, Lee. Lee! No, Lee! Not now! about trying to save him at the very least buy him some time By chopping his arm off do we know it works we don't know anything we know there's gonna be a lot of blood there's gonna be a shitload of blood what if he dies then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah let's do it let's do it maybe it'll work it's a big risk yeah we're down here without a lot of options. It's all right. Fuck it. Cut it off. Seriously? Yes. Yeah. This is gonna hurt so much. It'll be over before you know it. Just gotta get through. Yeah. Who's gonna do it? It was easier when I thought he was out. Seriously? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Fine. What? I'll She's go gonna as fast do as it. I can. <sighs> oh my god. <sighs> fast would be good. Look. You're <laughs> oh! Try to stay still! Just hold on! Oh god. Oh my god, that was horrible. Lost you. You've been out a while, man. It's so bad. But maybe now I got more time. Do you think you'll be able to travel? You lost some blood. So. Yeah. Good. The elevator's open. Let's go. Will power will overcome everything. I'll bring up the rear. I don't want to bleed on anyone. Good idea. Let's go. It just has to be ladders. Jeez. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor or even the roof. You think it's possible for you? Yeah. Keep going. It just had to be ladders just had to be ladders out of every single thing in the world ladders okay down there remember quiet it's no big deal another arm would just get in the way jesus christ lee ah! oh shit oh. okay uh, i 
I like how the directors like make this style of cutscenes. I mean this style of scenes where I, you, they just suddenly want to scare us. <gasps> oh shit. What? What? Watch out! Damn. That was fucking close. Everything okay up there? Oh, just fucking peachy. Wow. Like, seriously? Seriously? Does that even need to be necessary? Remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't oh. follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Well, what do we do now? We need to get off this roof as fast as we can. It's not safe down there. We can't just walk through the streets. You planning on growing some wings? It's taking an immense amount of willpower to not make a crack about that suggestion, coming from the one-armed man. That joke will be funnier once we know if this works. <laughs> Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I... Uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost a lot of blood down there. If you find yourself getting winded, or worse, you gotta let us know. Okay. Probably <laughs> just need to go a little slower. <laughs> and I know we can't afford dead weight, so... Don't treat me like I am. We won't. Now what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now... Let's get our bearings. Oh. It's just amazing. He's gonna have a lot of respect for this. Honestly. It's an extension ladder. Oh. So sad. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Huh. Yeah. That could help. What? A jump? No. It's a bell tower. Like the ones Molly used to draw the walkers around the city. Oh, um... So... Why don't you just shoot a bullet at it? Why not? Worth a go. I mean, come on. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. I might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. There'll be thousands of them. But it'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. Oh, uh, okay. Well, that sounds like a good plan. What's over... What's this? No Some hell? poor bastard took a spill. Yeah, looks like whoever was up here painting that sign went ass over tea kettle. Oh, I get it. That's sad. Whoa, you need some help with that? I got it. Damn it. Oh, shit. 
the bells. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Wow. Respect, my friend. Respect. Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because, because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. <laughs> that thing looks a little rickety. Maybe shut keep up. that shit to yourself next time. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Alright. It's going to be okay. Oh shit. Just great. Holy shit, man! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? Um. Can, can I go by this way? It's locked. Shit. The exit in here's locked! Nope. So, um, well, they are just staring over there, looking like, oh, beautiful weather we have here, ain't it? Coming this way! Tons nice. of them! Jesus! Now get back here! <laughs> I have to jump! Come on. I think I have to jump! There's no way back! You can make it! It ain't that far! You got this! Got this, motherfucker. It's okay, Lee. It's okay. Jump! One, two, three, go! go! One big leap! Come on. Yeah! Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof. Oh. Nice. <laughs> He's so impatient right now, but understandable. Don't get mad. The boat's gone. No shit, it's gone. Relax. Ben, what happened? They were waiting for me in here. Who? Vernon, his whole crew. Was Clementine with them? No. He, he seemed pissed you guys lost her and, well, they took it. They're gone. Ben, you are worthless. What happened to your arm? We cut it off. Ben, I could just kill you right now. God damn it, I can't Vernon! Believe you didn't even put up a fight. Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. 
So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Krista's right. The boat was a pipe dream. We still go after Clem, and then we get out of Savannah and rethink our entire plan. Rethink? How about we just think for once? That's what I'm saying we do. Calm down, Kenny. Yeah, chill. Don't talk, Ben. We can do this in the yard. Seriously. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Get to the countryside. We dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Look, I agree with you. I think out in the country is the safest place to be. But you're not dead yet, so put a pin in that, okay? Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill? Bandits? Hey, chill! Here's some pills! Vernon, chill! Here's our fucking boat! This isn't my fault. I can't point to one thing that's happened that isn't somehow your fault! Lee should have left you in Crawford. Fuck you, Kenny! Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katja and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around, and stop wishing I was dead! No! You know how they died. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive, or dead, or walkers, or worse, and I don't know! So give me a fucking break! Oh, Ben, I'm... Oh shit! Here they come! In the house! In the end, it's also Ben's fault they are attracted to us. <laughs> what? They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? What? Not. We can secure this place. Krista. Search the house for weapons. On it. Kenny. Um, move anything you can up against the doors and windows. That's what I was thinking. Ben. Kill anything that gets in. You know you're talking to me, right? Ben, just do it! Omi! What is it? <laughs> Front doors! Oh, shit! <laughs> Honestly. Lee! Help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! A knife. Hurry! Really. A knife right now. Honestly. Take their goddamn arms off! One. Two. Three. And four. Now what? Get ready to fight. This place seems sturdy to me. I think we're fine. <laughs> Shit. This hit sturdy enough. Absolutely sturdy not. Sturdy my ass! Get upstairs! Go! Oh, Breathe! You're asking a one-armed man to actually push something. I'd rather be killing, you know. Everyone get to the end of the hallway. What do we do now? This upstairs. Upstairs. The get to the end of the hallway and take a fucking stand. We are going to run out of the trapped. Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. 
Five, four, two. You all know where to aim. Get ready. What? Next. Okay, we are dead. Let's go back. We are so dead. I'm out! Me too! Fuck! Where do we go? Upstairs! Up! Go! Forget about the gun. <sighs> Safe here. Um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's yeah. still bitten. Shut up. Okay, let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent III. Industrial... Need... Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, <laughs> not stupid jokes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm sorry. So... No ideas, then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access. A vent. Anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> nope. That's not an option. Hey. You're not looking great. And you're warm. I'm okay. Don't... What did that mean? She's at the hotel, where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Oh. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Stop it! We can't panic! Do you think that worked? I... I don't know. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not gonna do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't gonna happen. How do you know that? Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you! My arm is not the issue! I'm not the problem! The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem! Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. Then kill me, you son of a bitch, okay? Don't even fucking hesitate! I will! No, no. <laughs> You ruined that dude's face. Does it matter? <laughs> Look. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30 foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. I'll be damned. Oh, We're nice. We're lifers on Alcatraz here. We can't spend the next three months digging through a wall. If the rest is. <laughs> 
This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. Okay. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. Thanks, pal. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well... We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I am. Uh, and when it happened? I panicked. But now I feel it inside me. Like the day before you get the flu. It's horrible. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. Yep. You don't mean that. Yes, I do. So when we get this guy, what do you think? We figure out who he is, and why he's doing this. We can rescue Clem, but she won't be safe if this guy's not gonna stop. So, did your crew get into any shit before you met up with us? Is it possible to have survived and not gotten into some shit? And, you know, whatever happens to you... Uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? It's okay. The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off. What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to him. better than any other moments right it's now, what Krista. Want, okay? What about him? We gotta support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No. That was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. <laughs> the kid killed his family, so there's been some tension there. Really? What happened? Kenny's son got bitten during a raid by some gang that Ben was secretly helping. They used him. Kenny's wife died because of their son. Jesus. Well, seems like it got through to Kenny. Whatever that's good for. All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. Good idea. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that, uh, feeling any better? Um, I can handle it. Pain, that is. I'm just really goddamn tired. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? Nah, not really. I feel like a man who got bitten. So, take that for what it's worth. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just... Fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. Well, as much as anyone. Lee's family's gone too. It'll be alright, Kay. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Yep. He 
wanted to die in Crawford. What's that now? When I had him there, in my hand. He wanted me to drop him. He asked me to. Oh, Jesus. What? I'm glad it was you making that call and not me. Yep. <laughs> this guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. The aforementioned Larry fella? See, Lee and I got trapped in a fucking meat locker with him. He had a heart attack, so there's this guy who, I should say, was built like a brick shithouse. And we're terrified he's gonna come back and eat all of us. What did you do? We were resourceful. Larry didn't make it out. Nope. No, he did not. We did, though. It's all water under the bridge. All we can do is move forward. Well... Cheers. <laughs> sure. Nah. Nah. I'm good at being drunk right now. <laughs> She's... Wow. Just wow. I'm through! Whoa! No walkers. Things are looking up. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. Yeah, sure. This place seems pretty sealed off. Pretty wow. doesn't does doesn't do it that well, alright? <sighs> Let's keep moving. Gotta go. Yeah. We've seen so many people. I don't know why these ones break my heart. What's heartbreaking is not giving yourself a chance. It's what Katya did. You did everything you could. Yeah. No, Lee. Well, you did everything you could. She left me. A son. People that cared about us. I forgive her, but it don't make it any less wrong. You don't just end it, because it's hard. You stick it out, and you help the folks you care about. So let's figure a way out of here and get that little girl. Good. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. Anything useful around here? Going out this window. <laughs> the streets are full. Hundreds of them. Hundreds, really. Uh oh. Let's just be brave about this. House is full, too. Stay quiet. What? This house is overrun, too. But this room is pretty... Well... Hey. At least it's safe, come on. Nothing other than personal items in here. Okay. Looks like um, we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. Go ahead. <laughs> it's going to be hot.
Please, no one fall. Please. Oh shit, it's creaking. Come on. Oh, oh shit, no. Oh snap, it's going to break. No! no. Ah! Me in my fucking mouth. Holy fuck! What are we gonna do? No, Kenny. Kenny and I can handle this. Dude, let me help you. You're already hurt. Even more reason we all don't need to risk it. You worry about her. Yep. And if all this goes bad, you might be Clementine's last hope. We'll keep an eye out. God damn it. I'm okay. Just get me out of here. Shh. Quiet, Beard. Or they'll be on top of us. Yeah. Try to keep your mouth shut. I'm sorry. Just get me up. My legs hurt, I think. We're gonna get your ass up. Really? I thought you... Shit. This ain't gonna work. Fucking hell. What is it? I'm okay. I'm okay. No. We can get you up. We can, uh... Ow! Oh, God! Oh. Nope. He's quiet. We can take our time and save his life. Nope. That's not gonna work. super quiet. That's not going to work, my friend. Shit. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> pull! Pull! Oh god, don't let them get to me! There has to be a way! Do you have any bullets left? This has only got one left in it. I'm out! Shit! Get the fuck out of here. What? Go back! She needs you, Lee! Kenny! This is not a discussion! Hell no, man! I'm not leaving! What did I just say? Let's get Ben and get out of here! No! No, Ken! What the fuck, Kenny? Lee. Lee, it's okay. Katja wouldn't want this. Damn it, Ken! Yeah, she would. I either save the kid or I get to see her. Either way. Now get back up there. No. Go get that girl. Back, you sons of bitches! No, no. Damn it, Kenny! God damn it! Oh, fuck! Kenny, please! No! What happened? Damn it. Just lost him. I couldn't do anything. Ben was really messed up. Kenny couldn't leave him and it was just fucked. God damn! God! I heard a shot.
Kenny made sure that Ben didn't feel any more pain than he had to. What? It was Ben's biggest fear, you know. Kenny had one bullet and that's how he used it. God, poor fucking kid. Either way she would have died. You saw them die? Nobody was getting out of there. I'm sorry, Lee. He did what he had to. All the way to the end. Damn it. We should go. Right behind you. God damn it. We've just lost a very good friend, a pal. He was the closest character to Lee. Do you want to talk? Kenny was my friend. He could be tough to like, but I agreed with him most of the time. So, we were assholes together, I guess. Yeah. Look, Lee, this is a shitty time, but I want to clear something up. What is it? Now with Kenny gone, means Omid and I have to stay safe. For her. Yeah, you do. Let me take all the risks. That's not what I mean, necessarily. It's what I mean. It's what we gotta do. What? Fox, be careful across here. Seriously? What the hell is this? Who was the smart ass who built this bridge? Oh shit. Wait, hold on. Let me make a prediction here. I'm going to fall on one of these steps. I wonder which one. Am I? No? What? River Street's just up ahead. I'm quite surprised uh, since it is this Telltale is oh, the one careful. that actually made this game. Wow. Even the buildings are full. They never know where their next meal is. No, they don't. I, uh, I didn't mean. It's fine. Let's go. Oh shit! His complexion changed. probably gonna turn in like two hours or so. He's gone really pale. Wow. Marshall's hotel is around the corner of the block. We have to cross here. Well, at least it doesn't look like a death trap. Yeah. Who's going first? You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg and you're walking for two. I'm obviously not doing so hard. So, sh so she's so really she pregnant. You two should go across first. You're the lightest, Omid. I'll follow right after you. If, if this thing creaks... I meant what I said about Clem. I didn't doubt it. I appreciate it. How are you feeling? Just look at my face, goddamn. Good enough. Uh. Krista, you next. Lucky that 
I didn't get the goal first. <sighs> what are you gonna do? I'll figure something out. There's not a ton of options. I'll look for one then. Can you help me? I don't know what we can do from here. Anything! It's fucked, Lee! Fuck it. I'm going for it! Going for it? What does that mean? It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? Find me when you get down. What the fuck does that mean? It means what it sounds like. Hotel's around the corner. Find Clementine and me as soon as you can. You're crazy! There's no other way. Yep. in episode 2 Wait, wait, hold on a minute. Um, how how would Lee know where to go? I got us adjoining rooms. Hello. Okay. This is Sybil. You look horrible. And you're missing an arm. Go over there. Fine. Put your things down. Let me out! Who's out there? Fine. Quiet, please, sweetie. Your things. There. Just be cool. Do I not seem cool? Yeah. Um, no, not at all. Good. Go sit down. 
I trust you, my friend. Do you know who I am? Yeah. yeah. I know who you are. You sell my car. Out front, then. You see anything else you want in there? Not a whole lot left. I did take from you. Your people didn't? I didn't agree with it. That's what Clementine said. Why didn't you? It wasn't right. It wasn't our stuff. That's real good of you. Look, what do you want me to say? I don't want you to say anything. I want you to know what happened. Okay. Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? Not on purpose. If it were on purpose, you'd be a sociopath. I hurt her. So bad. What? What do you mean? My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. Oh. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. And then we came back, and all our stuff was gone. Your people, Lee. That asshole in the ball cap. His stupid fucking wife. I could have earned her trust back if they hadn't made our situation so desperate. I'm sorry. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. Wait. They didn't get far. I found them a day later in the road. Do I look like a monster to you? We all do. Some more than others. I'm not like you. You let that little girl get fed disgusting human meat. She didn't. I would do it differently if I could. You abandoned a defenseless, grieving woman. You weren't there. You brought her to the most dangerous place in this city where she could have died. I couldn't leave her at the house alone. She would have been better off! No, she wouldn't. How would you know? You weren't Nobody in my situation. What the hell is that? So what? You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm gonna hurt you so bad. Oh, is that still? It doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I found Clementine on my radio, I wasn't even mad at you. I was coming for the others, for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Our? Lee, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. No. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. No, shut up. 
It makes sense. It's not happening. Let us go. No. No, I don't think so. You're going away, and we're starting a new family. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... I'm glad too. Oh, shit. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. Oh. Oh. Spam! You die, you monster! Desperate asshole. <laughs> a single armed man can actually defeat a. D oh shit! Now's not the time for talking, now's the time for spamming! What the hell? Come on! Is this it? Shoot, just shoot. He would have come back. That's right, sweet pea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. Your arm's gone. Why? That's so scary. I had an accident. We'll talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Listen. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Claire, no, it's okay. It's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Why? I'm sorry you had to see that. He was going to kill you. And take you. Yeah. It's not like we have much of a choice, but Oh look what's inside. Oh what? Jesus. She is still alive. Don't look in there. No, I know. Can we just zip up the back for a moment? Which way out? Through there. Right. Um, can I get my cleaver back? Nope. So let's go. There may be a zombie attack after this. I don't know. Maybe. Oh shit! Thought so. Savannah. 
Maybe that could happen to Kenny as well. Who knows? I mean, he had to fought off a lot, and maybe he could have survived. We didn't get to see him die. Oh no. Clam, we don't have a choice, alright? Uh, the intestines. I'm sorry, Clem, you just have to do this. We just have to. Oh, gross. Oh. <laughs> So sad. It's I thought it was gone. I thought you were gone. Thank you. <laughs> the look on her Stay face. Right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around. And don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. Stay calm and go past them. Guys, coming towards us. Nope. Ignored. Oh. Oh. That's her mom. Close to death. I was so scared. I, I, I thought you left me. I, I, I saw my parents. Yeah, I know. I know. They didn't get to you, right? No. Well, we got away. They're dead for sure. As fast as we can. Well, we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. I'll protect you. We'll push no, through. No, no, that's crazy. I saved you. We're safe here. I locked us in. Get that door open. I can't. Do it! Nope. It was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. Pull on three. One, two, three. Oh. <coughs> See? All right. Clementine, buddy. Mom is gone because I cut it off. 
Why would you do that? Because I was bitten, Cleo. Please, no. No. Th that's not true. Yes, it is. There's no time to be upset. Okay. I'll try not to be. Ooh, jewelry. I think there might be a way out over there. Good, good girl. Let's go. Uh, I might be a little slow. I'll help you. I don't think you should do any more moving, Lee. <laughs> oh. I got you. You can lean on me if you have to. I'm okay. I'm okay. You probably can't support I my I was weight. helping by bringing you in here. Yeah, you helped. Oh, you did, honey. It's awful out there. But they want to chew me up. It was hard. I don't know how you did. But you did good. Okay? Keep going. We're almost there. Oh. <laughs> Get up, Lee. The door is right here. No. All right. <clears throat> it's gonna fall. I can't. You have to. Them. I can't move. This is it for me here. Please, please, try to get up! <sighs> Come on, Lee! Ah, <clears throat> oh, damn it. I can't. You don't have much time. You gotta do something. Please. Fast. Like what? You're gonna have to make sure. I don't turn. You won't, though. Clem, no. I will. You know what you have to do. No. I can't. There's no way. Clem, honey, please. We'll figure it all out. Don't worry. There's a chair over there. The way out's through there, Clem. I know. Just start by getting that door open. It's locked. It's uh. no big deal. It's just a glass window. Uh. Huh? Ow! Oh. Now twist your hand. Ah. Uh. There's a baseball bat under the counter, Clem. You can use that. Use the bat to shatter that window, so you can reach in, okay? Okay. Watch out for broken glass. Oh. Good job. Don't be afraid of him, honey. You're smart. Yes, it. You're smarter than all of them. Grab the chair, Clem. Use it to reach in to the lock. This will be easy then. He's got keys. Probably to that door. And everything you'll need. Get the gun as well. There's keys. And a gun. You're gonna need both of those. There are handcuffs on the ground. Get them. 
okay, Lee. You have to handcuff the walker. You can kill it easy then. I don't know, Lee. You can do it. Just be careful. Move around the side and jump away if he gets close. Lee. You can do it. Go, Clem, go. Strong, Clem. You, you can do anything. But I'm little. So you'll grow. That mean nothing. You go see bad stuff, but it's okay. My parents. It's so horrible. I, I can't imagine, sweet pea. And now, you. Please, please don't be one of them. Please don't become a walker. There's only one thing you can do. You know that. Yes. I don't know if I can. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no. It's okay. It's okay. Megan, first days we met. Do you remember? Oh. Yeah, I do. Those memories. And I went out to rescue that boy, Glenn. Met a girl. She'd been bitten too. All she wanted was to not come back as a walker. Lee. And I remember how hard it was to do that. But I'm glad I did. You don't want to see me like one of them. Okay, Lee. I can do it. I I can. I don't need it, Krista. Probably looking for us right now. Stay on high ground. Don't go too far. You'll find them. They'll take good care of you. There's some people who you can trust. And Clem. Keep the hair short. Keep that hair short. I will. I'll cut it myself. Great. Good. And also... What? What is it? Ha <laughs> ha 
guys, um, this is it for The Walking Dead Season 1. I hope to actually see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye guys. Hope you enjoyed this. Thanks. Krista, is that you? Oh, hold on. <laughs> 